Okay, Sam, thank you. Justice for Julian, an emotional day in the courtroom. The father of the three-year-old boy brutally murdered in a grocery store parking lot, speaking out. Heartbreaking loss for this entire family. It was his first chance to see the woman accused of killing his son. 19's Katie Tursek has our story. Well, good afternoon, Bianca Ellis. The defendant was smiling and laughing. She even refused to answer the judge, but all eyes were on Julian's father as he made a statement. Just do whatever you can to keep this monster behind bars. Justice for Julian. Today, a plea from Julian Wood's father to keep his son's accused killer locked up. The first time Jared Wood has spoken out since his son's murder. She took everything from us. There's nothing that could you ever replace my son or anything that my wife and I, and our, even our other kids, are going through. 32 year old Bianca Ellis refused to cooperate during her court video appearance, so the judge ordered her to appear in person. That was when she pleaded not guilty to eight felony counts, including aggravated murder and murder. Bond is set at $5 million. Police say Wood and his mother were violently stabbed a week ago, today in a grocery store parking lot in North Olmsted. Sadly, little Julian did not survive. However, his mother did. Ellis is accused of stealing two knives from a Volunteers of America store nearby and then walking over and attacking Julian and his mom. Ellis took off and was seen walking down the street with a knife. Police quickly arrested her. It, it's, it's horrendous. A grieving father who laid his son to rest over the weekend. And a long, painful journey of court proceedings lies ahead for the Wood family. As for Ellis, she will be back in court on June 17th for pretrial. In Cleveland, Kate Tursek, 19 News.